In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate the least squares regression line uh, using the calculator, okay? So the TI-82 stats. Um, so in a lot of cases, you may well be given a set, a table of values, an X and X's and Y's, and then you're asked to find the equation for least squares regression line. Now, what you need to remember is that we are looking for the equation in the format of y is equal to a plus bx. Okay, so the actual uh, form of that can be found in your formula booklet. Okay, so on page 13, you're told that b is equal to sxy over sxx. And you're also told on the next line that A is equal to Y bar minus B X bar. Okay? So, if you don't have the option of using the TI-82 stats, then these formulas are there, okay, for you to use. They're in the formula booklet, and it does give an expanded version of that one, if you had to do this longhand. But I'm going to show you how to do it on TI-82 stats now. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the least squares regression line. Uh, so here's our data, and I'm going to show you how to input that first. So we're going to go to Stat, and then to Edit. And we're going to input these two lists into column 1 and column 2. So we're going to go with column 1 first. So we're going to have 2, 5, 7, 11, 15, uh, 18, 25, 27, and 30. Okay, and then we're going to go to the right. So we're going to input the second list into the column 2. So we've got 168, 160, uh, 155, 143. 145, 130, 115, 110, and 100. Okay, so now we want to go into stat and then to calculate. So right to calculate. We're not going to go to one, one variable stats, and what I want to make sure that you avoid is to not use linreg ax plus b. We want it in the form of b, uh, a plus bx rather. So you've got to go down to linreg a plus bx. This is the one you want, so number eight. Press enter, and then you want to get onto list one and list two. So second one for list one, press comma, second two for list two, press enter, and you can see what comes up is the value of A and the value of B that we require. Okay, so 172.4 for A and B is minus 2.326 to three decimal places. So on the calculator, we found that A is equal to 172.4 um, and it continues 038824 and we found that B is equal to minus 2.326. Uh, so I'm going to go to four significant figures for both of these. So what that means is that the equation of the line using this is 172.4 take away 23 point, uh, sorry, 2.326x. Where both of them are given to four decimal places. So that would be the equation of the least squares regression line that I need.